Hi beauties, it's me and today I am going to be doing like, it's this video is kind of like a story time but it's also kind of like an experience video, um, but yeah, so today's video is going to be different from my other videos, so this video is going to be about me being a psychic. I have had many psychic experiences in the past four years probably or so, like five or four years or something like that. Um, and like this stuff has happened so much that I feel like it's not a coincidence anymore. Um, but I would like to know your guys' take on it. So after you watch the video, comment down below what you guys think. Do you guys think I'm a psychic? Do you think it's just a bunch of coincidences? Or, like, do you just not believe in this type of stuff? I definitely believe in, like, psychics and aliens and, like, all that crazy stuff that, like, a lot of people that believe about, believe in. I believe in all that stuff. So that is why, literally, I think I'm a psychic. Like, no lie. I always tell people about this at school, at home, family, like, literally everybody. I like to tell them that I'm a psychic and I have psychic powers. So let me... So in this video, I'm going to tell you about the... Uh, different, the different psychic experience that I have had. So basically, all these stories I predicted, I've predicted stuff, and they've happened in like a month span. Okay, so this thing started when I was eight. So yeah, four years. Okay, so there is never a Hobby Lobby where I live until four years ago. So, one time, I was eight years old, and I was in my hallway, and I was playing with my toys, and I just, I just, like, I, I had never heard of Hobby Lobby, I, like, didn't really know streets, um, just, like, street names or anything, so I said something that was along the lines of there's going to be a Hobby Lobby and it's going to be on this street. A couple months later, Hobby Lobby was built on that exact street and it was named Hobby Lobby, obviously. So that was the first thing and I was like, okay, that's kind of cool that like I predicted Hobby Lobby or whatever, but like no big deal, right? Then, now, these stories are just going to be all over the place because they've happened over years. So, I don't really remember when they happened, but a lot of these happened last year in fifth grade. So, um, if you guys watch basketball, then you would know the Mavericks. Um, so, one time, my dad was like, who's going to win tonight? What basketball team is going to win tonight? And I said, the Mavericks. And later that night, guess who won? The Mavericks won. Um, so that was still kind of like, oh, that's cool. Then, at my school, the teachers write all of the kids' names on little popsicle sticks. And, like, they pull their sticks from time to time. And whose ever name is on the stick, that person goes and, like, they answer the question or whatever. So my stick is purple. I have a purple stick in my STEM teacher's class. So, I told the people that were sitting my, at my table, I was like, every time so-and-so, um, which is my STEM teacher's name, every time so-and-so picks a purple stick, I think it's my name. And the first person she pulls on is me. She pulls the purple stick, and it has my name on it. There are three other purple sticks with three other different kids' names. But she picked the purple stick that had my name on it. Now, at that point, I was like, this ain't a coincidence anymore. I'm a psychic. So that's when I became Psychic Kalesa. So a lot of other things have happened. So one time I was talking about this person who walks past our house a lot. And I was talking about him, like, blah, 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 blah. Five minutes later, dude walks past our house. That guy I was just talking about, I was like, I was like stunned. A couple days ago in school I was talking about this person and 
then literally right after I finished saying their name, they walked into the room. I was like, oh my gosh, see, I keep on telling y'all I'm a psychic. Like, I keep on telling you. And, like, there's just been a lot of other different things that have happened, but I um, can't remember all of them, but there is a lot of stuff that has happened that makes me think that I am a psychic. Comment down below if any of you have had any of these type of experiences. Um, I just think it's weird, and I actually truly believe that I'm a psychic. Um, there's a lot of other instances where, like, I said something and, like, it came true, or I said someone's name and they walked into the room, or I said a basketball team was going to win and they won, or, like, just a lot of the same types of stories, but just in different instances, if you know what I mean. But, yeah, those are my little psychic stories. Um, I think I'm a psychic. Comment down below if you think I'm a psychic or not. My dad thinks I'm a psychic. So, yes, I think I am a psychic. So, I'm a psychic makeup artist who also goes to school and makes YouTube videos. Alright, beauty. so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, like I always say, please like, comment, share with your friends, follow me on all my social medias. Go and check out my last main video. It'll be in the description box down below. It was a Make It Steam cover. And also, if you guys have not clicked the red square button down below, make sure you click that. Once you click that, a bell pop up. Make sure you click that bell to get notifications from my channel every time I upload a video. I upload for a week as I can. I'm still of you beautiful psychics, psychics in my next video. Bye, switches. Mwah.